Well, do you feel lucky? Huh? Do you feel lucky? Nah. Okay. My patron, Donald, all the way from good old Canada. Donald says, Rudy, I'm feeling lucky. I'm going to take the chance. I'm willing to throw the dice. And I said, all right then. So, uh, good luck, Donald. May all your foils be full art Okos. Huh? No? Maybe? So, good luck, everybody, and welcome, man. I hope everyone's having a great day. And we are going to get into the foily, glittery, thundery dome of fancy schmancy cards and all kinds of all that glitters. And we are looking for the big money no whammies today, everybody. We are looking for nothing rares in the middle and a crap out crag right out of the gate. Extended Talisman and the Black Lance Paragon for pack number one. So, so far, we're starting out here. Not too much going on. The old uh, Throne Collector's Edition stuff obviously has been coming to an end. I think we have only got one video left, and that is it. And uh, on the backs, we're only about a month away, everybody. So, ooh, Bone Crusher. Nice little bonus rare. And a Mammoth. We got a big Troll King. And boom. Ugh! That's what you want to see, folks, even in the non-home run slot. The upside down Rudy Robin Rich. And that what everybody says? Foil Mythic is definitely what you want to see. Yeah, everyone, can you believe that? We are a couple weeks away from resetting into the Theros collector's boxes. Uh, I mean, I, I guess. I mean, a lot of people seem pretty excited about those Pokemon lands. Another guy, we're getting garbage in that slot, aren't we? And a wild born preserver. Man, this is our ancillary slot here is terrible. A mammoth and two commons and three packs. Dude, Donald, where's your luck, man? Are you in that witch's cottage? What are you doing? All right, Murr, folk, for the showcase. Come on, uncommon, uncommon. All right, creepy chick. All right, Silverwing Squadron. At least we actually got a rare this time. Extended art, old man Rudy. And a Fires of Invention. So, so far, pretty much we got, what? A Foil Mythic is pretty much the best card we've got in that slot. No brawls, nothing, no brawl fancy mythics there. We, this is a, we've got a slow start today, everybody. Holy smokes. Where are the goodies? No rares in the middle. There we go. Provocateur showing up, looking all creepy as always for our brawl mythic number one. Extended Gilded Goose, finally. The extended art surprise and dancing in your pants. Like I said, uh, officially now, but I realize, I fully realize you can't get any extended arts, um, the box topper versions in the regular boxes. That really, uh, that really changes my perspective on a lot of those. I used to talk about how I felt these non-foil ones over here were like the kind of hidden thing. And I still thought you could get those in regular boxes, but it turns out you can't. Chittering Witch, eh, Spyglass Terrible, and a Gadwick again for the regular foil rare. Well, I'm not going to lie. That is a weak first half of the box. I'm not even going to sugarcoat it. So far, Donald, you have been slapped across the face and has you've not had a good start at all, man. I'm not going to pretend like you're hitting a home run because you're not. All right, Merchant Curious. All right, Uncommon, Bramble Fort Fink. Ooh, that is nice again. Wow, you're, you may be going for the full Monty on that bad boy. Robber of the Rich. Uh, full, wow, same with Gilded Goose. Look at that. So, kind of inverse. So, we've got Extended Art Mythic and a Foil Rare Gilded Goose. That was a very nice pack. All right, so maybe the second half of this box is going to be picking up some big steam then. That happens sometimes. We get some of these openings where we kind of, like, half the box is nothing, and the other half is just loaded. All right, and Oko's Hospitality for the Rare. A Giant Destroyer for the Extended. All right, Love Struck Beast. Foil Showcase Rare. Gorgeous. Looks like our first... Hot packs. So we got a block of hot packs. So we have technically, by the way, four more packs. We may have a five hot pack box instead of a four hot pack box. I can say that five times fast. So uh, we could be getting something. This could be a really big ending here. All right. So we're going to give it a shot. Fay of Wishes. Very nice bonus rare in the middle. Ooh, Rowan. Five drop Rowan coming through with the bonus mythic. Black Lance and a Brazen Borrower. Holy smokes. Extended. Not extended, I'm sorry. Showcase Mythic Foil. Wow. Okay. Holy crap. That is a fantastic pull, everybody. Wow. Okay. Honestly, I think I've only seen that card pulled one time out of the 60 boxes we've opened. 
Very, very, very tough card to get. Absolutely fantastic pack, everybody. I have no idea what the value is of that. Wait a minute. If we had no uncommon showcase card, is this our first showcase uncommon? Are you serious? That's strangely odd, but okay. All right. And we got the Banished to Fable. And Extended Lock Mirror and Dance in the Pants for the uh, box topper. Very nice. That's not bad at all. Okay. So we are at three of our four big full Montes, but I'm hoping we get a bonus since we have one more pack. I'm hoping we get a fiver here. Every once in a while, we've been seeing that happen lately. And, oh, wow, only two Showcase Uncommons in this whole box so far. Garrett, another common in that slot. Terrible luck on there. Opera oh, Fable Passage Box Topper! That's what we needed. Wow, has our luck turned on a dime. Very weak start. Epic, epic ending. Wow, what a set of four. Flippin' Brazen Borrower Showcase, and now a Fabled Flippin' Passage. Wow, as a box topper. Holy smokes. Oh, and a Royal Scions come in on the last pack of the box. Wow. There's Ann Rudy the Turtle. Mirror made. And we're back to just a regular. Wow. What a... <laughs> what a volatile box one, Donald. You have started, like, the beginning of that box was terrible. Like, I was going to rate it, like, a 4 out of 10. And then the second half of that box was just a home run chunk, everybody. So that I'm gonna say that was an overall. That's probably about an eight out of ten box. That was a that turned out very good. And uh, I that beginning was pretty just very very discouraging. But you know we didn't lose hope. We didn't lose faith. We all stayed the course and we ran the gauntlet. Shimmer Dragon, Rudy's Castle, and the I swear we get this particular rare in the Spiky Head Wolf. Are the two most common foil rares we get in these videos. Has anybody else notice that? For those of you who've watched a lot of these videos, have you noticed certain ones always come up? Like that's the, like I can't even remember the last time we got a Brazen Borrower Showcase Mythic. Like, does anybody realize how difficult that card is to get? It is extraordinarily tough to get. Anyways, just laying that out there. Ooh, Provocateur showing up for the second time today. Okay. Star Wars Queen looking good in the crazy outfit and love struck. Foil, rare, regular beast. Not the the showcase frame on that love struck beast is really out of control. Everybody, it is a ridiculous, ridiculous card. I mean, look at the art on that. Savvy hunter looking ridiculous. Also, yeah. I mean, I I love the art, but that's just me. I know a lot of people are not as big of a fan of the fairy tale theme, but I like it. Wizened and the Oath Sworn Knight, everybody. So we may do the same thing here. We may have kind of a more slower. Steady start here before we swing around. Um, it's kind of tough to tell. Um, we'll see what happens here. Beanstalk, Shepherd, and Rose. Uh, uncommon. And Extended Gilded. Wow. In a Castle Ardenvale. So that is our third. I think we had two Extended Art Gilded and a... Do we have a Box Hopper Gilded? No, that was Fable Passage. And then a Foil Rare. So I think that's three Gilded. So we got three... Do we say three Gilded Gooses or do we say three Geese? I'm not sure how we're supposed to say that to be professionals. See, that's why I've never been able to move out of the basement here. I always just want to stay down here for popsicles. It happens. All right, Giant Killer. Nice little bonus rare in the middle. Oak goes Hospitality for the little action. S uh, Spyglass is terrible. And the little Hush Money, just regular foil rare, everybody. All right, so yeah, first half of the box, just like the last box here. Uh, no excitement. Very steady. Nothing exotic. And uh, yeah. Nothing funky yet. Here we go. We got the Falmire Tree Queen. And another Rowan. Five drop Rowan, by the way. And Castle. And ending on a Gargoyle. So same thing as the first box. Really funky, man. Donald, you have the same weak first half. <clears throat> so I would assume the second half of this box is going to be the same thing. So we're going to have just home run pulls is what I'm expecting at this point. Intruder. At least is what happened with the other box. Garen Break, Smitten and Lone, and Banish into Fable. Here we go. Ooh, Circle Loyalty, Extended Mythic, and Giant Black Rudy Paragon. All right, so, again, I'm, I, I'm telling you all, this is the hidden slot of value. I'm telling you all. I've been saying it, especially now that I realize you can't get box toppers in regular boxes. I'm telling you all. All right, here we go. Ready? The sword. All right, here we go, everybody. 
Ooh, nice, gorgeous looking. Love that art on that. Beanstalk Giant. Ooh, Love Struck Beast for the non foil. Garbage common Rudy Griffin going to high school. Black Lance. And here we go. We're in the hot zone. Bone Crusher Giant. Here's our first showcase. Full Monty. So here comes number two. So hopefully we it's exact same order as the other box. Looks like right at the end, everybody. So yeah, go figure on them apples. Am I right? All right, here we go. Flaxen Intruder, Animating and Queen. Another four-headed Rudy Turtle. Lock Mirror. And another... <laughs> really? Didn't we get Love Struck Beast? That's, so we got... What are the odds of two? Really? Okay, so we got... I think that was one of the ones we got in the other box just a second ago. Okay, that was kind of awkwardly funky, but okay. All right, so come on. This is what's going to come down to. We need some heavy hitting to get some value out of this bad boy. Here we go, everybody. We got... Oh, Teller of Tales. First time we've seen you all video today. Teller of Tales. Nice brawl action. Opportunistic. And the Clackety Bridge Troll. There's our box topper. I love that art. Super cool, man. Old school. Dude, that just has that old fairy tale vibe. That's really cool. So there's our first box topper. Uh, hopefully we can get a bonus one since we've had some, this has been a weaker box. But we'll find out here in a second. And, oh, Garouk with the surprise. Wait a minute. Didn't we get the extended art in the exact same pack at the end of the other box? Wow. Okay. And a love struck. Look at those boat. Wow. In the clothes. Taste of death. No way. Is that an Emery? Flipping Emery box topper. Probably the best. Wow. What a pack. Oh my god. Emery box topper. Mirror extended. Taste of death. A Garouk and a love struck. Wow. What an amazing pack, everybody. That is a very expensive booster pack. All right, so last pack in the video. Maybe we'll get a bonus one here. We got a little merchant action going on here. Here we go. Reaper, Ardenvale, Merchant. Little Command Tower. Happily Ever After. Come on, one bonus box topper. Come on, baby. Nah. <laughs> Another Rudy. Upside down, Rudy's Robin. Upside down, Mythic. You got... This is a funky video. Duplicate foil Mythics of Robber the Rich. What are the odds of that? Uh, what a weird one today, everybody. Well, Donald, uh, enjoy all the cards. They are heading your way to Canada. Thanks for being an international patron there. And uh, obviously, sorry, I can't ship you anything sealed. But you know what? It's still a lot of fun. And I know it costs a few extra bucks to get this shipped over the border there and these loose cards. But other than that, thanks for watching. I appreciate all the support and kind words, everybody. And as always, I appreciate the privilege and honor to entertain you all.